gon' give it to ya what? Wait for you to get it on your own X gon' deliver to ya Go get some you gonna do a superhero landing. Wait for it. Woo! Superhero landing. It was epic. It was epic. A, a lot of work did go into it. I must admit, when I saw the nomination, I thought, too bloody right we should be nominated. Like, we worked so hard for that. It was unbelievable. The credit needs to go to the people behind the scenes. Me and Ryan are the faces of it, you know, but it's like Phil, Silvero, Rob Alonso, the stunt coordinators, Alex Kishkovich, Adrian Hine, and Jeff Robinson are the best stunt guys I've ever known. They're top of their business. You know, and then you've got all the riggers, just the whole crew, the first and second unit. You know, I don't know if I've, I must have filmed about 15 days on this with first and second unit. I was jumping between the two. So much work went into this. I mean, I started training for it in London, doing Filipino knife and stick fighting with Bob Breen, who's a legend in London in the martial arts world. Um, so it was literally like two months of training. One of them is the Invisibles. King Mob is a character that I would die to play. He is like a cross between Bruce Lee and the Pet Shop Boys. You know, he is like, you know, if Boy George um, formed with Jackie Chan, now he's the baddest mother around. He was a huge influence for The Matrix, I believe. Um, and the other one is Billy Butcher in The Boys, who's an incredible character. I'm probably too young to be Billy Butcher. Um, although things do change in casting quite a lot of the time, but, um, and I'd need to like put on some s serious muscle for him, but um, he's badass, man. Those two are like my favorite uh, characters and they're both, from London, they both talk like me. Billy Butcher's from Hackney, which is where I live, you know, and talks about it in the comics. So, um, yeah, King Mob and Billy Butcher, baby. I'm a huge Thundercats fan. Um, I would also love to be in like a Thundercats movie if they ever made one. I don't see why they wouldn't make one. I think, you know, all of the characters are so brilliant. You know, Chitaro is like my first crush. Um, and uh, you know, like, what's his, Snarf? is like, you know, it's so great. He's like Slimer in Ghostbusters. I mean, he's the cute, funny one. I think TJ Miller would do a great voice for Snarf. Um, you know, and then, you know, um, Lino is just badass, man. Thundercats are, oh, you know, it's, it would be amazing. I wouldn't change anything about him. Um, I wanted him to have a superhero costume at the beginning. Um, just because like it's every boy's dream to dress up in those superhero costumes. My son's got like all the Hulk and Thor ones from the Disney store and that and they're bad and um, kind of want to get like an adult one with the muscle suit and stuff, that would be cool. But um, no man, I love I love Ajax because you know, Rhett Reese and Paul Wernick are such incredible writers. They, you know, they wrote him so well and you know, with the help of Tim Miller, we were able to uh, create an interesting character that I, uh, that I love to bits.